I should actually mark this date and see when I do it again. It's probably somewhere next year. Good morning everybody! Welcome to a new vlog. Today it's Tuesday, the 10th of November. And although it's only the second week of November, I am already getting major Christmas vibes. All the shops are already getting there and I think it's one of those things that we are really looking forward this year, especially this year. For me, Christmas is something that I always look forward to and actually this year I am not sure how we are going to celebrate Christmas. So I, um, I'm thinking about that quite a lot. Probably we have to keep it very small, so that's going to be unfortunate, but it is what it is. So today I am going to get ready and my parents are going to pick me up in just a little hour and we are going for a very nice autumnal walk. I am not a very nature person, so for me taking a walk it's quite, um, quite special. I should actually mark this date and see when I do it again. It's probably somewhere next year. Although it's a very autonomous dark day, there is still some sunshine. So I'm going to use the uh, IT Cosmetics. Um, I think it's a CC cream. So I only have a little tester to check it out if I like it or not. So I am go. I already have tried this once, and it is nice. It has a nice coverage, and this one actually has SPF 50 in it. So I'm just gonna make a few dots on my skin. This is in the color fair because I have a very fair skin. I'm just gonna blend that in with my beauty blender. I'm always shocked how much of a face can change with just some little makeup. Using my usual Clarence Instant Concealer. Setting it with some powder. realize that you should do this after your liquid product. I didn't know that at first. The powder one is by the way from Maybelline New York. But you have seen this if you have watched my video of my makeup look from all drugstore products. Obviously these are not all drugstore products. Now I have found out that with this brush, this is an old brush from me, it's a very, not very nice brush to be honest, but with this I can actually not overdo the bronzer. I'm gonna try. So I'm not sure how good the camera did, did pick that up, but I have really just now a little color in my face, which is perfect for today. It's actually getting a little more sunnier right now. I like that. I really do. And I'm going to put on some mascara, like my usual ones from L'Oreal because they do the best job. So I'm going to use a very bougie lip balm. This is the Perwin lip balm with FPS 20. So I'm going to correct my mascara in my bathroom and then all needs left is lipstick. I can actually do that already. 
outside today I think we almost we almost walked for two hours so that's quite long uh, and I also did a workout this morning so I'm quite sure I have burned a lot of calories today I wanted to give you an outfit of the day before I left but uh, I was in such a hurry that I didn't have enough time before I left so well as you can see I have my white coat this is just a really old one from Primark. I really want to um, replace this for a nicer one. And a pink scarf. This is my new bag from Aldo, which I will talk a little more in a minute about. Just some um, very comfortable old jeans and my old black boots. Really nice to walk on and they have kept my foot really warm. Hi everybody, welcome back to the vlog. So today is Sunday, so I'm in a bit of a hurry to actually film this, edit it, and then also putting it online, which is my goal for today. And it's already late in the afternoon, so fingers crossed. I am actually setting up my Instagram account. I struggled just a little bit with my name, so I, I do actually have the same name for my YouTube as I have for my Instagram account. For Instagram, it's just all, it's just one big word. So, Mardana Style Diary all together. Okay, so I made an account. Now they ask for my birthday, which is May. 19 oh I'm not that old uh, my oh I need to get to my email let's do that I have a second screen over here if you can see that next the code isn't valid. The code isn't valid. Resend code. Seriously, this is not going well. Okay. Someone tried to sign up for an Instagram account. If it was you, enter this confirmation code in the app. Doesn't really matter if you do it on your computer, right? So I'm just going to use my same picture from YouTube as my profile picture because I think it's an okay picture, otherwise, I would not throw it in the bullets. Okay. Okay, so I've made my account and you can follow me from now on. I will um, try to link it also on my YouTube channel. I've seen people do that. I don't know, maybe you have to have over 100,000 followers or something, but I try and see what I can do and maybe it will work. So I've just set up my Instagram account. Um, 
for now there is not a lot of things to see actually because I did not have any pictures yet to post but if you want you can follow me from today and I will and I will do my best to upload some pictures very very soon I have loads and loads of ideas so I really hope I can bring them also to life and that you will follow me of course Hi guys, for the last part of the video, I actually wanted to talk to you about some uh, fashion bits and bobs and handbags and belts in particular because I have bought some new handbags and also and some new belts. I have, re I have mentioned in a recent vlog that I actually was looking for some new belts. I think it was in my clear out video, my wardrobe clear out from um, summer to autumn and because I was really into finding some new ones and I think I have found some pretty damn good ones. Like always I will leave all the information linked down below. I actually already filmed a part of the handbag footage but it was such a bad but it wasn't very good with the lightning not that today is any better because it is the most the most rainiest day of the i think year or something or the most darkest day this morning it was really great weather the sun was shining so i was really doing i was being very productive and then doing a workout taking a long shower and having loads of washes but then the weather just totally changed and it gets, got dark and it went raining and I'm totally rumbling. So let me just show you what I came to do. So you all remember probably my Aldo bag that I bought in my uh, video um, three everyday autumn winter outfits. I will leave it linked here or here I think for uh, if you have not watched it. Uh, I have not taken off all the plastic, but I will do keep it because I think it's such lovely. I also mentioned in that same video that I was really falling in love with that bag, but I really also wanted the small version. And it is this little handbag. Gosh, this is so... Oh, beautiful they have the strap to where it cross over body and it's adjustable which I think is very comes in handy I love this design it's not of all the album back so it's not their design at least I don't think so uh, quite spacious for a little handbag like this And I think I do know why I was so drawn to this because I have actually seen a bag from one of my favorite YouTubers who has a, a same uh, vibes like this one but only it's from YSL so not really in my price range but it's the exact, uh, exact same color scheme so that's probably why I was very drawn to this so yes they are very similar obviously but I just couldn't resist. I really have a thing for bags. But on the plus side, they're not pink. So if the Aldo bags are a little above your price, because they're not the most cheapest bags on the market, then I also have this bag. Also from this bag, I still need to undo the plastic. I did not have an outfit to wear it with. But this is a bag from the store Van Haren. As I mentioned in my last video, I bought loads of shoes from that website and I also bought this bag. It is that lovely burgundy red color. I just am in love with it. I love that it is gold chain because that is just so my vibes right now. Like I said in the recent video, I love gold hardware. You have one, two, and an extra little department here. Close with a magnetic. And I like that you can wear this one also just really short over the shoulder like this. Or you can actually wear it 
with a long chain and cross and cross body. This one was really really cheap. It was 19 euros and 99 cents. But I just love this color. It is perfect for this time of year. Perfect. So then I bought some belts, and this is actually a little bit of a fail because I just I just didn't really looked good uh, from the description of the belt because I thought it was a belt for wearing you wearing jeans, but this is actually a waist belt. Um, but I absolutely love this design. It's from Pinko. But like I said, it was for your waist and not for wearing it with jeans. So this one has to go back because it won't help me in any way. It is beautiful, but I'm not going to buy it. I also bought a belt from Guess and it came with a little dust bag for belts. So I thought it was very pretty. And it is this beautiful belt. The gold hardware again and just really um and just the g only the g from guess in the belt printed i think you can see it in the light it's also a little shiny really lovely and on the other side it is this really really pinky shade it's really light pink with flowers green and other pink flowers on there and all you have to do is just turn this so now it's like this and now it's like this again um like this again <laughs> So actually you get two belts for the price of one and you will keep it safe in a little dust bag. So this is an absolute win. Then I got one more from Aldo, same brand as the bags. It has also this lovely gold hardware and it's a white belt. I really want a white belt because it could be really nice for summer. I have some particular jeans that really do fit me well around my legs, but they're just a little loose around my waist. So obviously that's why you wear a belt. It's not only just like for fashion statements or something, it's actually also very handy. I'm not sure if the camera can see, if the camera will catch that, but it's not total blank. There's actually a sort of texture on it. I think the camera did cut that, I think, eventually. But as for all the things that I wanted to share with you today, I'm also going to end the vlog here. So really, thank you for watching. Thank you for joining me today. Please like and subscribe, and I will see you in my next video. Bye now! Oh, and don't forget to follow me on Instagram.